Hello everyone. This is uh, Inspire 2016. So we would like to give you a free tarot card reading for everyone. So the way we want to read the card is using the six card uh, major arcana layout. So the first card will represent how you feel about yourself right now. The second card will be representing what you most wanted at this moment. And the third card will represent your fears out of the situation that you have been going through. And the fourth card will represent what is going for you. And the fifth card will represent what is going against you. And the last card will be the sixth card represent the outcome according to your situations or the questions that you ask. So all of the spread will be presented based on your zodiac signs that means your sun sign rising sign your moon sign or whatever sign you have as the one that you hold dear in your deepest heart so let's begin the reading i hope that you enjoy everything and if you like the reading just please click subscribe and you will get the instant notifications every time we publish a new video right to your uh, youtube thanks Hello Taurus, this is Inspire 2016 with your weekly tarot reading for the week, commencing the 16th until the 23rd of May 2016. The first card for you is representing, how do you feel about yourself? Your card is, the tower. You feel that the disruption and sweeping change you are going through, or fear you are about to go through will be catastrophic. You need to recognize that such upheaval can force new directions that you never dreamed possible. Subconsciously you may have wanted change, but as is often the case, the solution isn't always as we expect. There could be problems relating to your property, or if considering a new property or move, progress will be thwarted. The second card for you is representing, what do you want most right now? Your card is The Temperance The appearance of temperance suggests you are craving some peace and harmony, a sense of control and wish to feel that life is flowing again. Perhaps you have been, or are currently going through some tough times regarding a relationship, financial worries or some other kind of loss. Take heart that peace will be restored, this is a time for you to be calm and patient and life will soon have a sense of normality again. The third card for you is representing, your fears. Your card is, the fool. You are afraid of making the wrong decisions. There is a warning here that foolhardy, impetuous actions could lead to major problems, Perhaps you feel that you don't have control over a situation, either personal or professional. You may feel unable to complete a task or stay in a current relationship and fear the consequences of your decisions. Perhaps you know deep down that what you want isn't really such a good thing. The fourth card for you is representing, what is going for you? Your card is, the High Priestess. All lines are open in your telephone exchange with your intuition, and there is no better guide than this intuition. So, listen carefully and the secret you want revealed will be shared with you. The fifth card for you is representing, what is going against you? Your card is, the death. This is a period of anxiety, depression and fear with all the turmoil and distressing events happening in your life. It's time to show what you are made of. What has now come to an end leaves room for brand new beginnings in life, love and career. However radical events may be in your life, believe that life goes on and life is what you make of it. The last card for you is representing the likely outcome that you may have. Your card is The Magician. This is a period of positive action with great potential. You are full of self-belief, feeling very empowered and will have the ability to think on your feet. The Magician is an excellent omen for success, 
it's time to show everyone exactly what you're made of. I hope that you enjoy everything and if you like the reading just please click subscribe and you will get the instant notifications every time we publish a new video right to your uh, YouTube. Thanks.